Nearly 500 years ago, Nicholas Copernicus hit upon a revolutionary idea that flew in the face of common sense. He said it was the Sun and not the Earth that held center position in the solar system. Copernicus looked at the heavens in a new and different way. In his name, the Copernicus Project now takes a fresh perspective on science teacher education. This is your introduction to a new series of teacher training films produced by the Copernicus Project. This project is designed for current and future science teachers on the secondary and elementary levels, as well as district and school administrators. The presentation is comprehensive, covering 25 chapters over five separate science sections, but it's broken down into small, bite-sized pieces. You can absorb the entire production in sequence like a feature film, or instantly drill down to a specific chapter that addresses your own area of interest. The Copernicus Project exists because of a critical need for science teachers across our country. These are our goals. To identify future science teachers and recruit from a diverse pool of candidates. To offer them high quality and focused preparation beginning at the community college level. And to provide sustained mentored support for both new and veteran teachers through ongoing professional development. Copernicus Project partners cover a wide spectrum of educational leaders K-12 teachers, institutions of higher education, parents, and the business community. The project's goals reflect what research underscores, that the single most important element in the academic achievement of students is the quality of their teachers. This video series uses an inquiry-based model that can help your students achieve clarity and that magical eureka or aha moment. Developed by the Biological Sciences Curriculum Study, the instructional model is known as the five E's, engage, explore, explain, elaborate, and evaluate. We call it teaching science in five easy pieces. This step-by-step -step guided inquiry approach gets students involved in actively developing their own understanding of science concepts. When a young student sees a rainbow, he might wonder, what makes all those colors? He is engaged. This is the first of our five E's the student will want to poke and probe and try to solve the mystery of the rainbow. To satisfy curiosity, the student explores the second E. He looks for answers and makes observations. Students work in teams so that when they come to the third E, explain, they articulate their observations, ideas, hypotheses, and questions with each other. As understanding dawns, the student elaborates the fourth E. He makes connections. For example, his understanding of how sunlight and water vapor interact to create a rainbow may lead him to questions about the nature of light and wavelengths. The student's journey to discovery through the five E's is self-guided in many ways, and they can even participate in the fifth E, evaluate, by assessing their own progress. The teacher, meanwhile, guides them throughout this exploration. He or she might spark the initial curiosity suggest experiments, and correct misconceptions. At the stage of evaluation, the teacher determines if the student has attained understanding. This is just a brief overview of the 5E approach to learning. In each of the five videos of this series, we'll go into more detail and show actual classroom examples of how the method works. Learning something new is not a linear process. In trying to make sense of things, we use our prior experience, plus first-hand knowledge gained from the exploration. Teaching with the 5E method enables a student to take hands-on ownership of the process. It has proven successful in teaching students of any age, including adults. As students engage, explore, explain, elaborate, and evaluate, they absorb and build knowledge piece by piece. The series is broken into five separate videos, biology, earth science, physics, chemistry, and elementary science. Each video takes you into the classroom and shows examples of all five E's. So now you're ready to explore the five-part video series. It was created with a new vision for shaping ideas, shaping minds, and shaping the future. For more information on the Copernicus Project, please visit our website at copernicusproject.ucr.edu or call the number on your screen. Copernicus Project 
is a cooperative venture of UC Riverside, the Graduate School of Education, and Dean Stephen T. Bossert, the U.S. Department of Education, and the Office of Post-Secondary Education. We're grateful for the support of many other educators, institutions, and faculty members like you.